Hi, this is Pastor Simon from Kenya. I want to answer a question that I've been getting from my viewers. How do I choose my friends? You know, the people that you work with or hang around you, they can be of great influence uh, either positively or negatively to your life. And so how do I get the best group to hang around to be my friends, my buddies? Number one, choose friends who can exhibit a good character. You don't want to have friends who are bad news. You don't want to have friends who are like so much way away from good character. You need friends that will exhibit good character in you. In 1 Corinthians chapter 15 and verse number 33, the verse of the Bible says, part company corrupts good character. So you need friends who can exhibit that good character in them and in you. Number two, choose friends who are dependable. Don't get people in the time that you are so much in need, they are not there. Don't choose people that the Englishman says, a friend in need, a friend indeed. You need people who are there. They can stand with you. They can pray with you. They are reliable. They are dependable. These are the kind of friends you need to hang around with. These are the kind of friends you need them in your, in your friends list. These are the kind of friends that you can call on and you are sure that you will get along. So, number three, you need to have friends who can give you wise counsel. You need advice. And where do you get your advice? Get it from people who can give you wise advice. Make sure that your friends can offer to you that emotional support and that guidance. They are able, when you are sick or you are down, you are in a situation, they are able to come and check on you and be able to at least distract you from that situation and just get you out of that situation. Determine if you have a good balance of friends that are both givers and not only takers. They have a balance between giving and taking. Most friends will be takers, but they're not be givers. We have those who are naturally givers, but you need to have a balance of friends decide if your friends can bring out the best in you hey you need somebody who can steer you up so that the hidden talents the hidden best within you it can come out you need also people who can commit to you effectively people whom you can respect people whom you can't trust i'm gonna read you some few uh guidelines here that you need to watch out when you are choosing your friends remember when you are making friends in a person you need to meet them and not just do it online online has got many things what looks like on the line may not be what looks like in reality so focus on making friends in person Number two, uh, you need to join being a class that is able to interest you in building up that friendship. You know, join a club that is building up friendship. And you are in that class, you are able to tell. Number three, volunteer to focus on that course which you believe in. And in that which you believe in, you will find like-minded, like minds which will be able to work along with you. And then if you have some of your acquaintances with you, turn them into friends. And lastly, stay away from people that talk you down, that focus on your negativity, that abuse and misuse you. Get away from them. They are so dangerous like a virus. They're in fact worse than coronavirus. Stay away from them. Stay completely away from them. Get along with people who are able to get you move on a higher level, move 
out of yourself to another realm of focus. Well, with this view, stay blessed. <laughs>